Hi, I'm Chad Hawkinson. I'm Senior Vice President at IHS Market, and I'm responsible for our engineering and product design businesses, as well as our technology businesses. And both businesses are really focused on providing information and analytics to decision makers across all of our industries to help them make, make the best decisions in the face of increasing complexity in their markets. IHS Market has over 50 years of experience in the standards world. And by working with companies over the last 50 years, we've recognized that standards and the proper application of those standards can drive dramatic cost improvements into the companies that do it right. And so what we see is people take standards, which when you think about what a standard is, it's essentially the encapsulation of best practices around the industry that's agreed upon by lots of different companies. But the companies that then take those standards and bring them back into their own companies actually then suboptimize the deployment of those standards. A lot of companies take these industry standards and then put their own standard overlay on top of them, their own internal standards that might change the way that standard's implemented within their company. And one of the challenges we see is that a lot of these companies implemented these own internal standards without really necessarily doing the best business case, right? Does the incremental improvement or an incremental uh, standard that they're developing for their company. And does that really drive the benefit that they want in terms of reliability, maintainability, et cetera? Because one thing is sure, when you create your own standard, you're paying more for anything that you buy with that standard because you're now on your own instead of taking advantages of the scale that an industry standard provides, you've now got your own internal standard and your costs are up. Is it worth it? And in many cases with our work, we found that for companies it isn't. Lots of these standards are, are being adopted inside companies but less efficiently than they can be. And by helping companies look at the way in which they adopt industry standards and use them to best effect, we can improve their processes, improve their efficiencies, improve their ability to get products to market, and also ensure that their costs are as low as possible on those products. So by proper application of standards within those companies, we can drive dramatic cost improvements. Internal standards are something that we see heavily used in oil and gas and aerospace and defense. And by reducing those internal standards and really trying to focus on use of industry standards, we've seen massive cost improvements in the companies we've worked with. For one example, a large operator in the oil and gas space asked us to look at their valve standards, their own internal valve standards. And what we found by looking at their internal standards is that they overspecified a lot of the valves versus the industry standards that they could have used. And by backing out that overspecification in their valve selection process and getting back to the industry standards, we were actually able to save them about $25 million a year in procurement costs by being able to just simply procure based on industry standards versus their own. So as you can see, that's just one product class for a large operator. And we were able to save $25 million a year. Apply that across all the areas where there are internal standards, the opportunity to save money is dramatic.